Hi, welcome to the gallery. This is basically all the kids' work that are in Sierra Providence that are battling cancer. Basically all the way around we have about 64 pieces of work. And as you go down the hall you're going to see that each one of the pieces has an original touch to it and also different mediums. We're also using inks, watercolor, a variety of other materials such as canvas, acrylics. And the kids are working off things that they feel and also things that they've been introduced to. So there might be images that correspond with other images that they like, other artists, or something else that they wanted to try and learn how to do. There's a lot of different styles that are in here. This is a mural piece done by all the kids for one of our kids that passed away from cancer. Her name was Cynthia. She was very interested in music. So all the kids painted an instrument that they thought would uh, kind of sing her into heaven. And all the kids not only put their hands in, but they painted their hands individually styled to give her love and also to remember her. This piece is really special to me. It was done by a, a kid named Omar. He came in here not knowing that he had testicular cancer. Um, and he did a, a self-portrait of himself. If you notice up towards the top, this is a, the body, the figure. He's got himself hooked up to his IV, and then along with that, he's showing parts of his body to accentuate how he was feeling um, and some of the things that he, he's going through. Uh, this was the first painting he did when he came in. It's all acrylic, done on paper, and um, it just kind of displays some of the outreach that we're doing um, to get kids involved in what they're telling us through their artwork. This is the chemo coaster. It was made by Paul. He was 15 when he got diagnosed with cancer and he had been going through treatments for a number of years. This is how he portrayed his idea of what cancer was about. If you notice he goes from sick to sad to ugly to happiness to crazy to confused to tired to mad and relieved. He uh, finally found out that he's in remission so he's doing quite well.